So this video is about can I as a realtor help you buy a bank owned home and get a good deal? And the answer is of course with a lot of details. Now about three or four years ago bank owned homes are about 25 to 28 percent of our market here in Central Florida. So chances are one out of four houses you looked at would be bank owned. Now it's about 5% or one out of 20. And people still think it's almost a myth that the bank owned home will be cheaper, will be a better deal. It's definitely something that you want. So they are sometimes cheaper. Why are they cheaper? Well, you think about a bank owned home. That means that somebody didn't make the payments in the house for probably six to 14 to 18 months. And then the house went to foreclosure and then they took everything they wanted out of the house, then they moved out, and then the house sat there empty for at least two to eight months before they put it back on the market. So the property has a lot of deferred maintenance. It has a lot of things wrong with it. And these houses are cheaper because they're not as a good a shape. So if you get a $200,000 house and you get it for 185, which is a substantial discount, and then you end up having to repaint and fix the roof and put some new appliances in and maybe fix the kitchen and change out all the fixtures and fix some of the, it's not a good deal in the end. So yes, the actual purchase price will seem cheaper, but if a bank owned home is beautiful, if somebody let their house go and then cleaned all the toilets and the closets out and made it beautiful and painted before they moved out and let it go back to the bank, then when they put it on, it'll be beautiful, but then it'll sell for just as much, if not higher, than a regular home because it's in good shape and people think a bank owns a good deal. So then they're looking at it more so it makes it more competitive. Most bank owns have multiple offers on them because everybody's competing for what they think is a good deal. And while the numbers look good, what doesn't look good is the actual condition of deferred maintenance of the bank home that you'll get. So when I send you a list of properties and you say I'm looking for three bedrooms, two baths, two car garage, this area, this price range, I'm always going to include the bank owned property. So if it's there, we'll look at it. It's almost automatic. You don't have to ask or look at it. And if you see a bank home and you want to favor that one, that would be great. Most of the time in this market here in 2018, we're going to find a resale home that's in much, much better shape. That's much easier to buy as well.